Hi everyone, Mr. Klopschen here again, and today we're going to be looking at how to hold the French horn properly when you go to play. So hopefully you remember how to take it out of its case and put it together properly. After you've done that, you want to put the French horn up like this so the mouthpiece is over on the left side of your body by your left hand. Again, if you don't remember, you want to hold up your left hand and you're going to see an L. The way you're looking at it in this video, it probably looks backwards to you, but when you see the L, that means it's your left hand. To place your left hand on the French horn, what you'll do is you'll take your thumb and you'll place it in this hook or kind of handle thing right underneath the French horn. I don't know if you can see that there, but it's right there. That's where I'm gonna put my left thumb. Fits in nice. Then I'm gonna take my pinky and I'm gonna place it within the other uh, hook right up here. So thumb kind of like underneath, and then your hand comes around over top, and your pinky goes in that one as well. And then you have your first, second, and third fingers on top of the keys, push them down. You should make sure that all three of your valves go down. Now, for whatever reason, one of the valves doesn't go down. It's not necessarily a big problem, unless it's the first or second valve. If your third valve is having a little trouble right now, which hopefully it isn't, don't worry about it yet because we will not be using the third valve for the end of the school year. However, please let your teacher know so they can help you fix it. All right, now that you know where to put your left hand, your right hand is gonna make like a C shape, kind of like this, like C is for cookie. I also kind of talk about it like the princess wave or the prince wave. You kind of wanna have your hand all together and kind of like this. Then you're gonna take that hand and you're going to put it in the bell. Now to do this, what I would do is I would put the, the bell of the horn on my right knee, so the mouthpiece comes right to my face. Then I'm gonna take my princess or prince hand that waves and sees for cookie, whatever you wanna call it, and I'm gonna put that hand in the bell about halfway up, okay? I'm not gonna jam my whole hand in there and block the sound. I'm gonna have my hand right on the bell like this, okay? And I'm not, uh, another big issue is sometimes people hold it like this. Now, C is for cookie. Get that in the bell about halfway up without blocking. You don't want to shove it all the way into the hole. And once you do that, that is how you're going to hold your French horn. So again, the right hand, or sorry, left hand, thumb here, pinky here, one, two, three. Your right hand, C is for cookie. Place it in the bell on the top of the, uh, on top of the bell and then about halfway in. And now you're ready to play your French horn. All right, if you have any questions, please reach out to your teacher and let them know.